Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Ingrid again. I'm coming to you with another scrapbook layout that I made and I wanted to show it to you very quickly. It's on a metal stand that you can get at Michael's and this layout features darker colors as well uh, more in the brown tones and the beiges and, um, and those types of colors. So zooming in here I have a strip of paper which I cut out with the Cricut. This is a piece of um, a strand of of a flat backed uh, pearl bead. This is a piece of lace. This is another piece which was actually a, a piece of scrap that um, from another from a different project and I saved it and I was able to trim it down and add it to this layout which worked out great. And then here are just some stickers. This actually says Utah but I don't think you could see it very well. Okay, Salt Lake City, Utah, I don't know if you could see it very well. Okay, and then here is another uh, sticker and I colored the inside of that red just to match. This label here is cut out with the Cricut and then on top I added a really pretty um, dimensional sticker. It's like an epoxy sticker and then on the sides of the epoxy sticker I put some glitter and some black bling and I ink the edges. Here's another piece of uh, bling. This piece here I cut out with the, the Cricut as well. Um, that again was from a different project. It was a different color, um, but I wanted to use it here so I, I turned it around and I just began spraying it with different um, sprays and was able to achieve this color. And then I felt like it was good enough to put on this layout. And then I just went on top and added some bling different blings. This is a photograph that I inked the, I, I cut the edges with one of those, um, you know, these kinds of scissors that have like the, you know, the different shape. I think the one I used on this was the postal shape. So I cut, cut it out with that and then I inked the edges in blue ink. And it actually holds up really well. It, the blue ink does not come off. Um, then I matted it down with uh, this background paper. Um, I put some more stickers. I added some glitter to some of the stickers. This piece here is cut out with the Cricut. Okay, and th these are Making Memories embellishments. The key <clears throat> and the locket. And this is a stick pin that I made um, and I just uh, colored the top of the pearl because it, it was like a beige pearl color so I just colored it with um, I believe it was one of my smooch paints and then here is a this is a um, recollections flower that I backed onto a um, I believe that this, that this flower back here, that flat one, I believe that one was from Oriental Trading. Um, I got a package of flowers and for dirt cheap, and that I also uh, glimmer misted. And there's another little, little tag on a string. This was actually from the packaging. I cut it out. I thought it looked so pretty. I said, oh, why, why would I throw that out? Let me cut it out and I'll just paste it onto my layout and it works so well. Here's a, a strip of paper that was going into the scrap heap, but I saved it. Here's a piece of doily from a different project that I was working on. I had that little strip, <clears throat> excuse me, I had that little strip left over. So I just added it to the bottom there very steampunk grunge vintage grunge type look to it I, I just really love it and 
more stickers. This piece here I cut out with the Cricut and I added these pretty epoxy glittered stickers with some lettering. And a bling in the center. And that is the layout. I'm going to zoom back out. And that in the background is my son. <laughs> he wanted to make a contribution to the video. That's his contribution. <laughs> okay, and um, so that's the layout. I really uh, enjoy the dark colors and I hope that you like them too. Thank you. Bye.